Squaring the Circle, Unraveling an Impossible Phrase. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating English phrase, square the circle. This expression is not just a collection of words, but a gateway to understanding both language and culture. So, let's embark on this linguistic journey together. To fully appreciate the phrase, square the circle, it's essential to start with its literal meaning. Historically, this term comes from a mathematical problem, trying to create a square with the same area as a given circle, using only a compass and a straight edge. This task was proven to be impossible due to the nature of pi, pi. Here, the literal impossibility sets the foundation for the figurative use of the phrase. In everyday English, square the circle is used metaphorically. It describes an attempt to do something that is seemingly impossible or to solve a particularly challenging problem. This phrase often appears in contexts where there's a need to reconcile two conflicting or very different positions or ideas. Let's look at some examples to see how this phrase is used. 1. The committee is trying to square the circle by providing quality health care while keeping costs low. Here, it implies attempting to achieve two seemingly incompatible goals. 2. As a mediator, her job was to square the circle between the two opposing parties. This shows the phrase being used in the context of resolving conflict. For English learners, it's important to remember, use this phrase in formal or sophisticated contexts. It's more commonly used in British English. Don't confuse it with, circling the square, which is not a standard phrase. I hope this video has illuminated the intriguing phrase, square the circle, for you all. It's a wonderful example of how language can encapsulate history, mathematics, and culture in just a few words. Keep exploring and enjoying the richness of the English language. Until next time, happy learning!